Howdy folks, this is Checkers, and this of course is Fallout 76, and we are here today at the White Springs Resort in the Presidential Suite to talk about junk. Yes, we're here to talk about junk. It's pretty much what makes the Fallout universe at the moment go round. So, how do you find the junk you need? when you need to find a specific piece. Say you want to make the excavator armor and you know that it's going to take you at least 60 odd springs or so. How do you find those springs? Well, there's a few ways to to do it. One, you can memorize everything that has a spring in it, or you can open up your Pip-Boy, come to items and over to junk and then let's see, let's find something that we know has a spring in it. How about a kitchen scale? So if you look at the bottom of the screen, you see our options. We can move the camp, component view, inspect, level up, drop, and sort. Let's look at component view by pressing the letter C. Now we are looking at all of the junk that we have in its component pieces. We scroll on down to spring and we see that we have a flip lighter, a gold pocket watch, a kitchen scale, loose spring, pro snap camera, pocket watch, and toaster. But if you look at the bottom options again, the last one now is tag for search. Click on that. And now if we look at giddy up buttercup, we can see that it does indeed contain a spring and pick that right on up. And if we come over here to this suitcase, we can see that it has a clipboard and by the little magnifying glass after it, it also has a spring. And looking at Giddy Up Buttercup, yes, we have the magnifying glass in front of it. And so we can grab that. And the Carlisle typewriter here also has a spring. So there is another way to access this feature, and I will show you that in just a moment. Now, we've looked at finding junk components out in the field, but let's be honest, you're going to really run into where's my junk when you're working on your crafting, right? So let's take a look at crafting or actually modifying and repairing weapons here at this weapons bench. Now, I have an assault rifle that I've been really wanting to repair and I can do that now because I have found some springs so I can repair this. So we fixed our suppressed assault rifle but I also have this suppressed severe combat rifle that I'd like to repair now though when I hit T to repair it I find out that I'm missing my springs again and I turned off the tag for search so I could show you that now I can press R from this view using this option to tag for search. Under repair, we can see that it has flagged the missing items for search. So you can flag items for search from your inventory under junk. You can look at things in component view from items, junk, look at the bottom bar from your options there. The third one from the left currently is component view. Pressing the letter C gives us a look at junk from its component pieces. So even if you just wanted to learn how things were built, you could look at this to see what do I have that has rubber? What do I have that has plastic or screws or silver? Everything now is scrapped, so it's showing us loose springs. And to tag something for search, you press the space bar to untag it, same thing. Now, the one thing about tag for search is you don't really want to tag a whole bunch of things at once unless you just want to grab all the things because it's going to be very difficult for you to tell which things are important to you. Like wood and steel are fairly easy to come by. Springs screws, gears, adhesive, and aluminum. These things are a little trickier to find. Black titanium can be, but the odds are if you found black titanium, you'll probably remember what gave it to you. But if not, you can add it to the list. Just keep in mind that if you add too many things into your tag searches, you will find things certainly, but it doesn't necessarily tell you what thing you've found. So 
it's really up to you to decide whether it's worth carrying the weight of all the things until you find out if you've gotten what you need for a specific project or if you're just trying to grab as much as you can. Alrighty folks, this has been Checkers with a look at Tag for Search and how to find the junk you need in Fallout 76. I would like to say thank you for watching. I hope you found the video informative and maybe even just a little entertaining. I would like to invite you to subscribe. Thank you kindly if you are already subscribed. I'd also like to point out that if you look in the upper right hand corner, you will see a small letter I with a white circle around it. These are cards and links to other videos that I've made. Most of all, though, I would like to ask you to please, please, take care.